show the machine. So the microcurrent machine, what it's gonna do, a lot of people say it's for firming skin. And yes, it does firm skin by elongating as well as retraining those muscles to go back to their youthful state. But what it does that's even more impressive than that is that we are energetic beings. If you come into my room, you see I joke about my woo-woo crystals. We're all composed of energy and that's how our cells communicate. So when we put this low level current through the skin, it's actually changing the permeability of the cell membranes, letting more nutrients come in, letting more toxins flow out. It's changing how our cells are communicating. So we are tricking her skin into being young again. Not that it's not already so young. <laughs> 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 Better product penetration, softer skin, just an overall glow. So that's what microcurrent's all about. All right, let's get it done. Yes. Okay, here we go. So what I'm using is a positive and a negative. This is a conductivity gel. People will ask why she why she looks like she was slimed on. Like this is not Ghostbusters. This is not Ghostbusters. It needs water and a gelatin base to conduct it. And my mom has commented that the gel is cold and I am not an OBGYN clinic. I am not <laughs> getting a gel warmer for you. So suck it up, people. So what it's doing is elongating these muscles and helping to retrain them. The skin, the muscles in our face are the only muscles in our body that are directly connected to our skin, which is pretty cool. Because if we tra retrain these muscles, we can get a change in the structure of how our skin looks. And I am not feeling, I feel kind of a prickly, but nothing that is painful or weird. It's more of a prickly. So when you hear that, pew, that means I'm cranking her up just a little oh, bit. Oh goodness, I'm being cranked up. And sometimes it can make a little. Oh yeah, now I feel kind of the, like a jumping. It's kind of like a vibration. Yeah, like a vibrating. Yeah. Because it's stimulating those muscles. Say goodbye to turkey necks, ladies. We can no, firm all necks. of that up. So then we move slowly up the face, work underneath the chin. That will help again with the turkey neck effect. Again, not that she has that. She's such a beautiful subject. Oh, stop it. And Nicole has termed... Uh, coined a term for my <laughs> facials. Tell them about that term. Well, why, um, while I'm getting rid of my turkey neck, um, uh, Mimi has, um, uh, how do I want to say, she's made this facial out of uh, just mere me wanting more for my buck, I think. <laughs> <laughs> and I've coined the term the full Mimi. Um, because at, not necessarily after the full Monty, but Mimi has the way of just making you so relaxed while she does her facials and we've coined it the full Mimi where she gives you a great facial, but at the same time rubs your shoulders and massages your head and just makes you feel like a million dollars when you leave here. In fact, just makes you feel like mush, um, ready to go home and take a nap. Um, I think you were mush for a good two hours I was after at the least, first facial. <laughs> yes, at least, at least. So the full Mimi is um, one of the um, facials that you can get here at <laughs> Fierce Beauty by with Mimi. Um, and tell them Nicole sent you. Um, but uh, I want my hair pulled just a I know, little bit. A little, little bit of hair pulling always helps. <laughs> so right now I'm going to zoom in. I don't know if you can see the muscle twitching. Um, but it How definitely feels, it feels fine. Mm -hmm. It's more of a, a twitch, but it's not, it doesn't hurt. But I can definitely feel the muscle fluttering. And a lot of times you see it more. Sometimes you can see right oh, around yeah, the right mouth. Oh yeah, right there. I can feel it in my teeth. Sometimes if you have a lot of dental work, it will interact with the metal in oh, your now, mouth. Now you tell me. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Now you tell me. Because I got a lot of amalgams <laughs> too. So what I do when I'm on the cheek is actually kind of stick my tongue in that in that cheek just to kind of protect it from being near the fillings. And now how, how long is a treatment, Mimi? A treatment, this is going to be an hour and 15 minute facial with a microcurrent. Um, you're going to get some level of exfoliation in that um, included with the the standard is going to be micro uh, or an enzyme exfoliation you can also add dermaplaning um, dermafiling microdermabrasion a little bit more aggressive of um, 
exfoliation mm -hmm. if that's what is best for your skin. And then how often should you have this treatment done? That is a great question, Nicole. I'm here for you. So if you have advanced aging, the older and, and the saggier, so to speak, that the skin is, the more attention it needs, the more frequent visits. So more like weekly, up to about eight to 10 treatments, mm -hmm. and then you can go to a monthly maintenance. Okay. So, um, but if, you, if you're, I'm, this is going to be targeted as well for younger clients that aren't sagging yet. Prevention is a lot easier than correction and knowing how much more than just skin retrain than muscle retraining that this does. Doing one of these in between your monthly facials, do this in January, do it quarterly, is going to help your product at home to penetrate better. It's going to help keep that skin young in more of a preventative uh, preventative realm so you're not wouldn't maybe have to go to the weekly treatments as you got older if you take good care talking to you mid 20 year olds 30 year olds you need to start coming to see me early don't wait until you're already aging so uh, what is the course of treatment Mimi what are so um, a d desired effect would be eyebrow lift kind of talk about what what you're looking for when Lifting it comes to here this sagging that happens on the lid here um, crow's feet diminished, parentheses diminished too because we're firming all of this, the underneath, the turkey waddle, and as well as neck, neck lifting. Okay. And so you said twice a month, once a week. So once a week Could ideal. Could be as frequent as once a week. Once if a you week. you can't do once a week, come twice a month or, you know, if you could do the monthlies, then you do the monthlies until what's going to happen is these, it's like the muscles go into the gym. The first time you go to the gym, you're not going to be buff, I wish. But um, after you go to several sessions, then those muscles are going to start to change and hold that retraining longer. So if you come once a week, my mom was getting it done. She said she felt the lift. All these lines in her forehead were gone when she left. And then she feels those effects diminish as she's come weekly. Those effects are lasting longer so that then she can back down to once a month. She doesn't want to see me that often anyway. <laughs> and so everybody's different. Obviously, everybody, yes. everybody's different on their projected plan of care, if you will. Yes. What is the average? If someone said, you know, I want to do this, what could they expect on average to commit to? I would say ideally commit to six treatments at, at minimum and at least twice a month. Okay. to come and see a, a big difference or at least come and try it out. I always say come in for a first facial first. We can take an analysis of, do a real good analysis of the skin. You're going to get a one hour I feel that facial. in my scalp. In your, in your scalp. scalp. Yeah. This is the best scalp yeah. massage in the world. Oh. This is why I knew you'd love it. Oh, yeah. See? Those are my the, scalp. Those are the sounds she makes when she's Ooh, so ever so happy. I make some sounds. <laughs> that is, oh, and when they're farther, when the wands are it's, farther apart, or the whatever they're called, um, that is when I feel whatever is going on. But when they get closer together, not so much. Because once, if they touch, which you notice I'm never touching them, yeah, then the what crud, happens? Then is the that off? Is that like Harry Potter stuff or what? Kind of. Then your head, <laughs> blow, your head blows up, and falls I'm off. Va Baltimore or whatever the hell his name is. <laughs> you, you turn into a frog, pretty much. Okay, don't, don't, don't cross, totally... don't cross the, the, what does the Ghostbuster say? <laughs> don't cross the things. Yeah, don't cross them. So a safe, effective treatment, we can go at the pace that you're able to go at. It's wonderful to add to already to your skincare regimen. I just needed a new toy. So, <laughs> Well, I appreciate you letting me be your subject, Mimi. And um, we're going to go back to the full Mimi now without the video. So um, I do highly recommend anybody come see Mimi and ask for the current thing oh, with me. the wands or whatever they're called. Microcurrent. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Bye.